Ahmed Mohamed, IFL TV, MTK Global, we're in El Mati, Kazakhstan, joined by my brother Andrew Fernandez from Sutton, who's like yes. 10 minutes away from me in the UK, <laughs> and we're all the way over here. Oh um, man, what a journey. It's been a, a mad couple of weeks for you, obviously at a much wider scale with the Anthony Joshua win yeah. over Andy Ruiz, you're involved with that, but tonight is special, Independence Day, and Sultan Zerbek picks up his first uh, title. He's my boy, you know, he's, he's my bread and, and, and butter, you know. We found him, like me, well, a friend of mine in Spain, he spot him, you know, we started some conversations ages ago. Then um, I spoke to MTK to sign him, so it's a long story. So this boy for me is, 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 is like my son, you know. He, mm. he, he truly, you know, the love I feel for him is, is like I feel for my kids. Talk me through the fifth round stoppage tonight. Um, I'm happy for the title, you know. There was a, bit, a few kind of like, I'm not, I don't want to be kind of like... Um, quite negative um, there is a lot of things to work on he's only 23 as well so um, it's a good it was a good step up for him very tough guy and um, yeah I mean happy happy with the performance but as I said you know there is lots of room to improve for a 23 year old I think now what eight professional fights or nine uh, nine nine professional fights and seven, uh, stoppages. seven stoppages yeah. very early on in his career yeah. boxed in different countries all over the yeah. world um, how good is he Angel oh. The potential of this kid is, he, I don't think there is, there is kind of like a ceiling for him, you know, because in the gym he always keeps improving, you know, he keeps improving, uh, he listens, you know, um, I think if he, if he stays focused, this kid will go all the way, mm. 100%. You've been, in, you've been with him for a long time yeah. now. Uh, How's that relationship going? It must be getting better and better. Oh, amazing. I mean, you could see when he won the title, you know how he jumped onto me. <laughs> uh, our relationship, as I said, sometimes the language is not there, but, but it's actually the love that we feel for each other. You know, this, this, this kind of like relationship is, is, is something more than, than, than boxing. It is a lot deeper than that. How do you get over the language barrier, though? Uh, sometimes in, he understands the combinations. You know, he understands when I say, it's like, do this or, or do that, uh, use more of the jab. He, he understands these things. What about when you tell him off? Eh? What about when you tell oh him God, off? Oh he understands. <laughs> he will see me if I'm if I'm in a kind of like in a bad mood. So, <laughs> um, I asked him what he wants in the future, and of course we can see this guy's going to go right to the very top. So I'm sure world titles are an ambition one day, yeah. uh, whether that's a year, two years, three years. Interesting though, he did say the name Javonta <laughs> Davis. Maybe because of the understanding. I mean, I think by the time he'll probably step up, I mean, Javonta Davis, you know, maybe he'll probably like start making lightweight. I'm ready. You know. Uh, oh, he says he's ready. <laughs> I'm ready. He's ready. <laughs> <laughs> but he's always ready. He's been asking for this title for a very long time. Um, we'll see that with MTK, but I want to take it steady because he's only 23 years of age. He's got a long career in front of him. And uh, yeah, I mean, the world is, is, is down to him. Hmm. He definitely understands English, though. Yeah, of course he does. <laughs> you see how he says, like, yeah. I'm ready. WBC. <laughs> yeah, WBC, I'm ready. <laughs> On a personal note, Angel, yeah. uh, as I said, it's been a mad couple of weeks. Oh, of in Firstly in Saudi Arabia yeah. and uh, now here in Kazakhstan. You must have been so much hard work with uh, Team Joshua and Rob McCracken yes. over them weeks uh, in Sheffield and, and especially with Sultan preparing for this. You must be very proud in a year like this. Oh my God, I mean, yes, I mean, it's been very frustrating because Isaac hasn't been, been uh, fighting, you know, and ending the year, you know, being part of uh, Team Joshua and regaining the titles back. And now, I mean, ending with, uh, with the WBC with a title and with a special, you know, person that is for me, Sultan, it's just amazing. So I'm really looking forward to 220, to, to really. Well, listen, as I said, uh, well done for your achievements Thank this year. You. I'm sure there's so much more to come oh, uh, I'll next pray year. i for that each day. And uh, look forward to the, to the journey with Sultan, your input with Team Joshua, and also hopefully see Isaac Chamberlain back in the ring hopefully, soon. Hopefully, 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 you know. I'm sure he will, you know, because he's, he's mad talented as well. So uh, I really hope, you know, he, he, he definitely get back into that ring because he deserves it. Definitely. All right. Cheers, Angel. Safe travels so much, back man, to London. Man. Yeah, you too, man. And, uh, oh, oh, oh. Have a nice And Christmas. then you! <laughs> <laughs>